The Data Tables plugin for jQuery offers enhanced interaction for standard HTML tables. Developers are able to create highly interactive tables with dynamic sorting, filtering, and pagination without having to write custom server-side code. As always with jQuery plugins, there is a module that integrates the plugin with Drupal. The Data Tables Drupal module integrates the plugin with views. The views integration allows developers to create a data tables table with just views and no custom code. The module also offers a theme function called theme underscore data table for rendering tables programmatically. In this video, we'll create an interactive table using the views and data tables module. Before we begin, download and install data tables and views. Then download the data tables plugin from datatables.net. Extract the file directly into the data tables module folder and the path to the plugin should be data tables slash data tables. Now that we have everything set up, let's go into views and create a table. So go to structure, views, and click on the add new view link. We'll call the table data tables and select data tables from the display format dropdown list and click on continue and edit. Just add a few fields to the table. They can be any fields. For this video, I will add the node ID, title, and type field. Click on the full link in the pages section and change the pager to display all items. We need to turn off the views pager because data tables implements its own. We'll configure views to display all items, but please use some common sense. If you're dealing with 100,000 items, you may have some performance issues. Now that we have a basic table set up, let's test it out. Save the view and go to slash data tables. If everything is working, you should see a table with pagination and a search filter. Now let's return to the edit page for the view and we'll add dynamic sorting to our columns. Click on settings in the format area. Check the sortable checkboxes for all the columns so you can sort each column. If you scroll further down, you can configure certain parts of the table, like elements, display, and pagination. It's important to understand that some of the jQuery plugin options for data tables may not be available through views. If you need to define some custom configuration for data tables, you have two options. You can programmatically render a table using the data table theme function or implement data tables using JavaScript. Once you have finished configuring the table, click on apply and then save the view. Refresh the views page and you should be able to sort by each column. 